Hi, today's topic in our Arnet Cloud series is going to be assets. What are these monsters and how to configure them? I'm going to show you in this video. When you log in to your Arnet Cloud, you're going to find a tab called Assets right here on the left. But first, let's talk about what assets are. Assets are a handy little thing that can make your life a bit simpler, so you can make more sense of your data, rather than just looking at everything clumped together or looking at each individual sensor, you can make your own groups of sensors. I like to think of them as items that logically group or aggregate the data from multiple sensors, so you can operate with them a bit more easily. Assets can be clusters of sensors in a certain location or even measurements during a specific time. If this sounds a bit complicated, let me show you what I mean. For example, here you can see I have an asset called Greenhouse Zone on the left, meaning it's a group of all the sensors that I have physically installed in the part of Greenhouse. Or another example, this asset is called Dismantled Summer Tent, and it's a time-based asset that will show you the measurements of sensors during a specific time. In this case, from June to July. So, how do you create a new asset? You start by clicking New Asset button here on the bottom right. You can name it and also add a description if you want. After clicking Create, you will get this window where you can see all your sensors on the left. Choose the sensors you would like to add to your asset and drag and drop them here on the timeline. In my example, I have a building with two classrooms. In each classroom, there's an Arnet 4 sensor measuring the CO2 level. Of course, you can always add more sensors to this asset. Later, you will be able to see all the measurements from these sensors without necessarily seeing which sensor the specific measurement is coming from. After you click Save, a new asset will be created and you can always see it here in the Assets section. These here are the latest readings from the sensors that are added to this asset. So, in conclusion, an asset is an item that lets you structure your data in a way that you can more easily operate with it later. Create graphs or add it to the dashboards, create alarms and so on. And that's it! Thanks for watching! Until next time.